Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Xbox Tavern's YouTube channel. My name is Daniel and I will be reviewing for you today Verde Blanc, Ghost in the Castle. Developed by Winterwolf Games and published by Rattalika Games, this is the sequel to Verde Blanca's Full Moon. Let's get into it. As its predecessor, this visual novel has multiple endings again. You're solving another mystery. There's a variety of mini games which you can play and the best part of the game is it's got that comic book inspired art style. I'm not gonna to lean too much into the story. I'm just gonna go on what the gameplay is like and how I felt with it. It's basic, it's the same type of Rattalika visual novels that you are expecting. It is achievement heavy focused, it's can be sure it can lead you down multiple paths there are multiple choices i think each question or choice that you get during the game there's always four options some are options where you have to literally ask the same type of question again again and again just so you can prolong the story or to get what you need to solve this murder if you've played the first one you're a carbon copy for the second game with just a new area you're in italy this time that's it as i mentioned before if you're looking for a good storybook game i would possibly miss this one if i'm totally honest with you if you've played the first one you've definitely played this one they're exactly the same if you're looking to get achievements this is a rattle like a special i think it would take you about 15 ish minutes to get the 1000G to boost your gamer score. If you'd like to read my conclusion, please head over to xboxtavern.com where you'll be able to see the scores, as I said, the conclusion, as well as some positives and negatives about the game. Please make sure you like this channel. There are plenty more reviews coming. There's also opinion pieces, as well as our weekly news segment. And of course, the podcast. Make sure you get on the podcast. It's a hoot. I've been Daniel. This has been Xbox Tavern. Until next time, guys, see you soon.